hi guys welcome back to my channel it's your girl Agent Nicole and I'm back with another video you see the title you see the thumbnail and you can see that today I am doing a sneaker collection 2021 showing my favorite sneakers out of my collection the ones that I wear the most the ones that are in rotation the most my favorites some gems and yeah, um, before we get into the video, don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. And, you know, stay tuned for next co more content. So, without further ado, let's get straight into the video. Okay, so, we're going to keep it simple for these first pairs. Um, these are, they're actually the same shoe, but they're in different colors. The Converse Hike um, style shoe. I got them in red and in black. Both of these that I got for Christmas. Um, I got, I can't remember if I got, I got these for myself. Um, and the other ones were a gift. And I like the, so you see you have the pink along the white as well which i love um it also has pink right here and the chuck taylor on the star is in pink as well um it gives me valentine's day vibes and you know i'm a valentine's baby so yeah got these to go with an outfit that i had for christmas um which i wore so yeah these are the first pair pair don't judge these are the shoes i wear these shoes almost every day um to work wherever because they so damn comfortable like these converse are so damn comfortable it's ridiculous um and then they're in black so got the same shoe in black as well you see the front is oh job i'm embarrassed showing this shoe if you can see it it's kind of dirty um Say it's the plain old black hike shoe as well. Had to get my thumbnail, but yeah, black on black, well, black on white, but all black. Um, I like the shoe because it's simple, it's comfortable. I can wear with damn near everything, and yeah. So those are the two Converse that I have. Those are the two Converse that I have right now. Moving on, I'm trying to see what I have. Okay, we're just gonna go ahead and get into my Adidas, which both are Yeezys. Um, the first pair I'm about to show. Oh, I'm just so embarrassed about showing them because of how busted they are. Um, but if you watch my Chicago vlog. These are the shoes that I got myself for that trip. Um, these bad boys right here, which need some TLC. Um, but yeah, this shoe right here is comfortable as hell. Whenever I wear like my neutrals or whatever, I'll throw on this shoe. Um, I need to figure out how to clean this side but other than that this shoe was a lifesaver in chicago when we was walking around and it went with damn near every anything that i wore during the day i could wear this shoe with um but i wore this to the airport and with my denim on denim look I wore this shoe um yeah i got these on goats um let me see so those, the two Converse that I showed, I got those both from Journeys. I got one from Journeys and I got one from Goat. Um, got these off Goat. To me, look, if the price is reasonable, I'm going to pay resale for it. If the price is outrageous, I'm not paying resale for it and I'm not going to shoot. Like, point that period. If I can't get it on sneakers or wherever the shoe is dropped at, I'll go to Goat, figure out, see... Do I want to pay it or do I not? 
if I if I like the shoe and if I want to pay the price for it, I'm gonna pay the price for it. So yeah, got these off go. The next pair are a new one of the newer drops of Yeezys, the three fifties. These icy bad boys are here. Let's see. Oh lord, there we go. These are my top two favorite shoes. Um, so the shoe is like mesh on the inside. And yeah, the only thing I don't like about the shoe is the the mesh because it can sometimes the shoe can become uncomfortable after a while of wearing it. But other than that, the sole is comfortable. The shoe is fly as hell. Um and this is a very 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 different like style. I like the mesh detailing of the shoe and the color just this icy blue i just love this hoe um got these off goat as well and yeah i will link these shoes down below if they're on goat i will link them down below um those shoes that i got they're still on there i like them yeah i love these shoes top two top two this is my number two favorite shoe out of my whole collection is these easy 350s now we're getting into my nikes and my jordans um the first shoe i'm trying to see which one i want to show first i'm gonna show my air forces but they're not regular air forces whether well, or not like the regular white on one these right here oh my gosh there we go i love the, the color of the check, the detail, and then it has a little thing right here on the shoelaces. It's gold. Look, that's all I say. It's not a regular Air Force, okay? I got these last year. I think I got these from Champs. Either Champs or Kids Foot Locker. A Foot Locker. I got this shoe at. Um, I think I was looking for something else that day. I can't remember. And I saw these and I was like, these is kind of fly. These is fly as hell. It's not a regular Air Force. It's a regular Air Force, but it got a little twist to it. And, you know, I was like, let me just get this shoe. And it was a reasonable price. I was like, look, last year I was on a sneaker craze. Like, buying shoes damn near every week. So yeah i had to get these and i got them um i wear them a couple times not really that much um but yeah these these right here fly fly as fuck next shoe these low jordan ones right here which is the orange and black ones got these from Foot Locker as well. These are in his kids, six and a half. I like the suede detailing of the shoe, the colorway of the shoe. The shoe is also comfortable as hell. I was really getting shoes that I wouldn't usually get or that I didn't have. So I, and look, if I like it and I feel like it's a fly ass shoe, I'm gonna get it. So I got it. my next pair are these low Jordan 11 braids. Um, yeah, I got these babies. I think they came out like around Easter time last year, maybe or two years ago. These are in a six and a half in boys. I did get these in store. Um, I can't remember what store, but I got these. So backstory, y'all know every Christmas there's always a Jordan Eleven coming out during Christmas time, which is a Christmas shoe or whatever. I remember one Christmas, it was for the, I think the Concords. 
or no, it was like the ones that were all white and had like the blue on them. I remember one Christmas, me, my mom, my brother, my sister stood outside waiting in line for these shoes at the mall. We went to a mall that we know like most people don't go to, so we're gonna be able to secure the shoe. Entered the rap entered the raffles at the stores. And guess what? I even put in a raffle for my friend during the time. Guess everybody got the shoe with me. Everybody got the shoe with me. I was so hurt, y'all. When I tell you I was hurt because I just love Jordan 11s. I was hurt. Like, I was pissed. I cried that whole day because I was like, what the hell? Like, how is everybody else getting the shoe with me? Everybody else got the shoe with me. So, yeah. Got these. And I also have the high top ones. As well, but I just don't know where them shoes at. Like, I don't know where they at. And those were the ones that came out two Christmases ago. Um, but yeah, like this is an iconic shoe. Like this style and Jordan ones are just so iconic. So that is why I cried out for the shoe. Um, and also, like sneakers have been in my life for forever i remember every year for my birthday while i was in high school they also they always had like the valentine's day jordans come out i got those shoes every time and i would wear them on my birthday because i was like come on now like it gotta happen um but yeah a little backstory of my sneaker fails and my successes um the next shoe is like I feel like this is a shoe that nobody really has and it's very slept on in my opinion and I love what it represents so that's why I got this shoe as well which is the Jordan High Sisterhood um, exclusives that dropped last year like look at this shoe and then the inside has like these little flowers or whatever. Yeah, like little flowers. Bro, this is actually like women on the inside. Can't really see, but there are women on the inside. I didn't know that. So, I love this shoe. One, because what it stood for, which was, it was like the sisterhood shoe. It's like a capsule that they had. Um, the colorway is perfect. I love the mesh, like detailing the check right here, the silver accents. Um, and then it also comes with the two different colored shoelaces that come with the shoe. I haven't like worn in one shoelace just yet. Um, cause this is how they came. They actually came with the two shoelaces attached to the shoe. I just love this shoe. Um, I don't really wear it that much, but yeah, this is one of my, I would say like my unique pickups. Cause I feel like most people don't have this shoe. This shoe is very slept on. Um, so yeah, I got it. Got it um and yeah it did have like on one of these shoes it was this shoe right here it had the jordan charm on it as well but it came off but whatever so yeah got my got my sisterhood jordan highs jordan one high on this next shoe is my all-time favorite this is my number one favorite shoe out of all my shoes that I have at the moment. Um, this style has become very popular over the year, um, which are the dunks. And I was able to. The pink and white ones. Oh my gosh. Come on, focus. There we go. I was able to get these babies right here. Um, these are 
in a size US 7, which is in women's. This It was a women's shoe. I tell y'all, I love this shoe. When I saw it first on sneakers um, for the upcoming jobs, I was like, I gotta have this shoe. I don't know how I'm gonna get this shoe. If it's on gold sneakers, whatever, I'm getting this shoe. Like, point blank period, I'm getting this shoe. I love the white, I mean, the pink shoelaces. Like, the pink on pink right here where the shoelace holes is. And the shoelaces. It was amazing. And I love the style of the shoe. This shoe is very, very comfortable as hell. I have to get me more dunks. Um, there are some that I missed that I wasn't able to get. But I'm going to get them. Even if it's late or whatever. I'm, I don't care when I get a shoe. Look, I got it. Um, so, yeah, these are these. These are my favorite shoes at the moment. Like. If I had to pick a shoe to wear for the rest of my life, okay, it wouldn't be these because <clears throat> after a while, it started get tight around my feet and it become uncomfortable. So if it was a if it was a shoe that I would have to wear for the rest of my life, it would be these right here. These would be the shoes if I had to wear these for the rest of my life. It would be this one because it's it's stylish and it's comfortable. So yeah, so that's all for the video. My shoes. If I can find the shoes, I will link them below. If it's on GOAT or whatever. Um, that's where I get most of my shoes from. And I saw some people might be like, why you pay resale for a shoe that you could get at a retail price or whatever? Look, as you can see, most of my shoes are Nike. Me and sneakers are not friends. Me and the sneaker apps are not friends. I'm all for 45 at this point like i don't win on sneakers so i'm not even gonna try like i will still try but i just be like i know i'm not gonna get the shoe i know i'm not gonna get picked so let me just go and go see how much the shoe is and i'm gonna get this shoe on go um yeah that's that's why i shop mainly on go for my shoes it's also easy to shop on go any shoe that you want um they also have like reliable fast shipping. They do the authentic authentication to make sure the shoe is real. So I I stick to go. I heard about stock eggs and mm, I don't have time to play with stock eggs because I'm telling you, if I get a fake shoe, we're gonna have some problems. Um that's my sneaker collection, mini sneaker collection, my favorites. Um that I have. If you'd like to see more videos like this, comment down below. I will link the shoes that I can find. Um, and yeah, stay tuned for more content. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. Follow your girl on the gram at Asia Nicole O. Me zero. That's where I be. Um, and I'll see you guys in the next video.